Palmyra's Arch of Triumph was built 1,800 years ago to mark a Roman victory over the Persian Empire. But now it's fallen, destroyed by the modern-day equivalent of the Vandal Hordes, ISIS. Just the latest act of pointless destruction by a group bent on obliterating the past. In May, when ISIS took control of the desert town of Tadmor, Arabic for Palmyra, local commanders said they would not harm the ruins, only pagan idols. Not surprisingly, the pledge quickly went up in smoke. First, they destroyed Muslim shrines, which by their obtuse interpretation of Islam are an abomination. In August, they rigged the 2,000-year-old temple of Baal Shamin with explosives and blew it up. Then a few weeks later, did the same to the larger temple of Baal. Meanwhile, the ruins of Palmyra have served as a backdrop for several displays of ISIS's perverse worldview. This summer, they used the city's ancient amphitheater to conduct a mass execution of captured Syrian soldiers. Across the areas ISIS controls in Syria and Iraq, the group has reveled in an orgy of destruction at one ancient site after another. Hundreds have been killed in recent months in Palmyra, either by ISIS or in attacks by the Assad regime. In August, ISIS publicly executed the 82-year-old retired head of antiquities for reportedly refusing to reveal where valuable artifacts were kept for safekeeping. Death and destruction, madness in the ruins. Ben Wiedemann, CNN, Beirut.